First up, we'll make a copy of the template. Type tiny.cc slash auto emails and press enter in your address bar. Then make a copy. Let's make a copy for each class or each group. So change the name of this copy to the group you're going to send it to. So let's call this send emails 7DTG. Then either enter or copy and paste the email addresses and the names of the student in the first two columns. Put your name in the salutation. Authorize it by clicking send email, send emails. When asked for authorization, just say OK and accept. And you're ready to go. So we'll go back to your Google Drive and just sort it out a little bit by moving the new file, which will be in your root directory, into the folder for that group or class. To use the template, let's go to our drive, find the file. Then what we want to do is enter the subject of the email. In the common message cell, type in the common message. If you need a line break, you can use Alt Enter. Don't just press Enter. And we'll finish the message here. Then at the end of the message, don't leave any extra space. The script will allow for that. On the individual messages, type the individual messages to the students or the results. Go over to column I and click on the little arrow, the little triangle, to see the actual messages. This is to unhide it. Check the spacing and the names, etc. You can hide it again by right-clicking and choose Hide Column. The reason we hide the columns is so that these cells here are small enough to read. Now to send the emails, click on the Send Emails menu item and click Send Emails. It tells you that it's finished the script and you're done. Now if you want to reuse this file, you don't have to go through all this again. Just go to the file that you've got, the Send Email 7DTG in this case. Delete the old message and the old individual messages and also delete the subject and you're ready to start again with a new email to everyone.